Hey everyone, Alexander Mathias here from SaxophoneMasterclass.com. Thanks so much for checking out this video. In today's lesson, I'm going to show you the number one way to start improving your rhythm on the saxophone. Now, I have a lot of students inside my Saxophone Masterclass membership that struggle with their rhythm, and the number one thing I get them to do is to start working to a metronome. So in this video, I'm going to take you through the different steps that you need to take in order to start practicing to a metronome on the saxophone so you can start improving your rhythm and being able to play your favorite songs with ease. Now, if you don't have a metronome like mine, which is this Korg TM60, you can either find one on Amazon or you can check your smartphone if you have one in the App Store and there's plenty of free metronomes in there. So I'm just gonna show you a few different ways you can approach playing with a metronome. The first thing you wanna do is set your metronome to a particular tempo. So I always like to start on 60 BPM, which is 60 beats per minute. This means that there's one beat per second. Let me show you. Okay, so we're at 60 BPM and we've got that one beat a second. Now this is gonna be a great way to practice your tonguing and I'm gonna show you how right now. So when you set your metronome to 60 BPM, I want you to start practicing tonguing one note per beat, like this. So you could hear there that I was tonguing on the note G every beat. So this is how you should practice your tonguing. Just practice playing on one note of your choice. In this case, I chose G. And practice playing that tonguing technique that you're focusing on every beat like that. So that was just me playing regular tonguing. And now I'm going to show you how I would practice legato tonguing. <laughs> So that was me practicing legato tonguing on every beat. Now we're going to do the same thing with staccato tonguing. So you get the idea. I'm playing one note per beat and I'm trying to get it evenly and in time as much as possible. So that's a great place to start when it comes to working on these articulations, whatever it is you're doing. Practice on one note and practice playing one note per beat. This is what we call a quarter note in music. And you're gonna see these types of notes throughout all songs and all music that you're gonna learn. All right, everyone, I really hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Remember, this is part of my saxophone success path, which you can get inside the Saxophone Masterclass membership. Just go to saxophonemasterclass.com forward slash membership to learn more about that. And not only do you get a curated path to follow with hundreds of lessons and videos and PDFs and audio files, but you also get feedback from me personally as you're working through the saxophone success path. So you're never lost, you're always getting feedback, you're always getting constructive criticism as you're working through the curriculum. Not only that, but there's also an incredible community inside the membership which you can share your progress with, ask questions, share your journey, encourage and motivate one another as you're progressing and mastering the saxophone. So again, we only open a few times a year for new enrollments. So if you want to see if we're open right now, just go to saxophonemasterclass.com forward slash membership. And if we're not open, you can just join the waiting list and be the first to know when we're going to be open for new enrollments. All right, everyone, I really hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you did, please like this video, please subscribe to my channel, and until next time, happy playing.